first things first, James Sunday, if you're going to spoil something, say spoiler alert before, then give time for people to mute the video, then say the spoiler, and then give some visual notification to say that you've finished the spoiler. Because I've not played Final Fantasy VII, and that's pretty much a massive spoiler, so thanks! On the bright side, at least we've found something that makes me angry. <sighs> Danny, on teenage stereotypes and mugging, I'd say that that's a valid thing, like Yaz was saying about people being cautious about walking down the street and obviously not wanting to be mugged and or raped and murdered and whatever. And whenever I see, it is a massive stereotype, but whenever I see like a group of people coming down the street with like caps and those things, I don't even know what they're called, they're like the thin material that's like a raincoat, but they have it with the trousers as well. If I see them coming down the street, I'm gonna avoid eye contact and maybe like cross the street if I can, because, you know, it's, it's a massive, it is a stereotype, but I don't wanna, I don't like confrontation, so I don't wanna provoke them in any way, so just keep it, keep it down and you'll be fine. And yes, ha, <laughs> Yaz, when you were talking about the teenage lads having bad manners, I do know what you mean, because there are a lot of people who are very rude, who don't say please and thank you, uh, who will put themselves in front of you and barge in to get what they want, and I don't know, I guess it's just the way I've been raised, but I don't like that, and stereotyping is bad. This video isn't helping because I absolutely hate stereotyping and I hate to stereotype people but the stereotypes are there for a reason because a lot of people do fit that mould and stereotyping is bad. <laughs> oh, and yes, don't worry, everyone likes eating. I like eating, especially chocolate. Uh, and it's unfortunate for you that you feel ill after eating chocolate because I can eat a whole chocolate cake to myself. I just be so good. Chocolate and fudge. Or banoffee. Oh, banoffee. Stop it. Why have you got me onto food? Why have you done this? <laughs> and the stereotypes that I fit into is not necessarily a stereotype because I don't give it away, apart from like the t-shirt and belt um, and the hoodie. But I'm a massive geek. Um, and I guess that's not portrayed on me as much because I don't wear glasses. So, somehow I've got really good vision even though I spend most of my time staring at screens. Uh, so I don't wear glasses. I'm not massively spotty. I mean when I eat junk food and bacon and sausages and stuff I get spots and things but I guess I'm not the stereotypical geek or nerd that is portrayed in films and TV and I think that's a big part of it. The whole popular culture influences do help to enhance this stereotype <laughs> this stereotype and it's just I don't know but the whole socially awkward thing and relating to geeks that I don't help that stereotype at all because with new people I'm possibly one of the shyest people, I, unless, unless say you see someone with an ocarina necklace, then you just have to run up to them. I mean, you've just got to go say hi and give them a massive hug. But other than that, I can't talk to people unless I know them. But put me and Yaz in a room together, people would not realise that we're possibly socially awkward as it's just people ever. I don't even know if I've said anything wrong. That's that's quite a trend I've noticed with these videos. I'll ramble. Not long. Not long. Not know how long I've taken to do the videos. Realise I've taken a long time and then not realise whether I've said anything of any relevance at all and then in the video.